A PowerPoint template is a pattern or blueprint of a slide or group of slides that you save as a pod file. Templates can contain layouts, theme colors, theme fonts, theme effects, background styles, etc. You can find many different types of free templates built into PowerPoint that you can apply to your presentation. You can also create your own custom templates and store them, reuse them and share them with others. Creating a presentation from Templates PowerPoint 2013 Start Screen has a search box that allows users to search thousands of templates and themes at office.com. There are also in-built templates for creating presentations. Start PowerPoint 2013. On the File tab, click New. You will see some of the templates in the startup window of PowerPoint. You can also search online templates and themes through search box. Related templates are displayed in the PowerPoint window. A list of various categories of templates is displayed in the category drop-down list. <coughs> Click a template from the available templates. Click Create button. The template will start downloading and it will open as a presentation in PowerPoint. The presentation will appear with all of the template slides available to you in normal edit mode. A thumbnail of the template will appear on your start screen. If this is a template you will be using often, then hover your mouse over its thumbnail on the start screen and pin it, so that it will remain among the top items on the start screen. Saving a theme from a template if you especially like the theme that a particular template uses, but do not really have a use for the entire template itself, you can create a presentation based on the template, go to the themes gallery on the design tab, click the themes gallery drop down, and choose save current theme. It will become a custom theme and will continue to appear in the theme gallery after you have deleted the template. You can add text, pictures, charts, audio and video in your presentation and edit and format slides according to your requirements. You can save the presentation by clicking file greater than save or save as option. Built-in templates. A PowerPoint template is a pattern or blueprint of a slide or group of slides that you save as a .potx file. Templates can contain layouts, theme colors, theme fonts, theme effects, background styles, etc. You can find many different types of free templates built into PowerPoint that you can apply to your presentation. You can also create your own custom templates and store them, reuse them, and share them with others. Creating a presentation from templates. PowerPoint 2013 Start Screen has a search box that allows users to search thousands of templates and themes at office.com. There are also inbuilt templates for creating presentations. Start PowerPoint 2013. On the file tab, click New. You will see some of the templates in the startup window of PowerPoint. You can also search online templates and themes through search box. Related templates are displayed in the PowerPoint window. A list of various categories of templates is displayed in the category drop-down list. Click a template from the available templates. Click Create button. The template will start downloading and it will open as a presentation in PowerPoint. The presentation will appear with all the template slides available to you in normal edit mode. A thumbnail of the template will appear on your start screen. If this is a template you will be using often, then 
Hover your mouse over its thumbnail on the start screen and pin it so that it will remain among the top items on the start screen. Saving a theme from a template. If you especially like the theme that a particular template uses, but do not really have a use for the entire template itself, you can create a presentation based on the template. Go to the Themes Gallery on the Design tab. Click the Themes Gallery drop-down and choose Save Current Theme. It will become a custom theme and will continue to appear in the Theme Gallery after you have deleted the template. You can add text, pictures, charts, audio and video in your presentation and edit and format slides according to your requirements. You can save the presentation by clicking File, Save or Save as option. In PowerPoint 2013, click the File tab and then click New. Click Blank Presentation. A new presentation with a blank slide will open in the PowerPoint screen. Adding text into a placeholder in a slide, the dotted border represents the placeholder that contains the title text for the slide. To add text to a text placeholder on a slide, do the following. Click inside the placeholder and then type or paste text. To change the line spacing, do the following, drag to select one or more lines of text for which you want to change the spacing. On the Home tab, in the Paragraph group, click the dialog box launcher. In the Paragraph dialog box, on the Indents and Spacing tab, make any changes that you want to, Alignment, Indentation or Spacing and then click OK. Note. If your text exceeds the size of the placeholder, Microsoft PowerPoint 2013 reduces the font size and line spacing incrementally as you type to make the text fit. Creating a new presentation. In PowerPoint 2013, click the File tab and then click New. Click blank presentation. A new presentation with a blank slide will open in the PowerPoint screen. Adding text into a placeholder. In a slide, the dotted border represents the placeholder that contains the title text for the slide. To add text to a text placeholder on a slide, do the following. Click inside the placeholder and then type or paste text. To change the line spacing, do the following. Drag to select one or more lines of text for which you want to change the spacing. On the Home tab, in the paragraph group, click the dialog box launcher. In the paragraph dialog box on the indents and spacing tab, make any changes that you want to. Alignment, indentation or spacing and then click OK. Note, if your text exceeds the size of the placeholder, Microsoft PowerPoint 2013 reduces the font size and line spacing incrementally as you type to make the text fit.